I-10451 Salem. We are going inside. This is really, you'll notice that everything in this house is upgraded a lot. So this front door is a nice upgraded door. Pretty consistent with the flooring. You'll see there's a little bit of, little bit of uh, bowing right there in the floor, but that's all I saw through the whole house. This is the, uh, this is what the tile looks like. And we'll just start from the uh, kitchen and kind of go through here. A uh, lot of lighting in here. So you've got a whole lot of lighting here. This uh, kitchen is heavily upgraded. Uh, they did have gas installed uh, because the home seller prefers gas over electric. So you'll notice everything in this house is gas, gas water here. We'll see that all in a moment here. But a couple things to point out, these cabinets are all very high-end cabinets. Soft clothes right there. Lots of utility here. And you'll kind of like this right here. You have additional adjustable shelves where you can put things like canisters and flour there. And then this right here. That is very nice. Very, very nice. It's a lot of utility there. Let's see if I can get this. Okay, so we are going through. You have doors now. Oh, let's talk about the pantry. Large pantry. Again, the home seller is packing up to leave. So there's a lot of stuff around here. Uh remote controlled fan. This I thought was very nice. Soft close doors here. <laughs> I don't think I've ever seen that. That's very, usually they slam together. And actually, the doors are done right. They're fastened at the bottom so they don't swing around at all. Um, so this was in addition, they did. They did bring a couple things. You have uh, they leveled the floor here, so there is one step down. We'll show you that in a second here. There is. They did bring air conditioning into here too. So this is done the proper way with air conditioning in here, as opposed to uh, maybe a wall unit. You'll see here too new windows. And they have these heavy duet shades. We move on to the laundry room. There's painted concrete floors. These are staying. These are high-end washer and dryer. These are staying. That is a tankless water heater. So it is gas. It only heats when you use water. And as much as you need. So if you need a a little bit of hot water for the washer, it'll heat it. If you need a hot water for a shower, it'll heat it. And it's continuous. You can go nonstop. This is a very, of course, a lot of storage in here. You'll see the home seller is a sewer. Does a lot of home sewing, but these sh industrial shelvings are stained. Um, so she's using this at a laundry rack. That leads to the garage. We'll see it from the other side. Uh, so you'll see here all these industrial shelves are going to stay behind and we'll just keep on going here and this is being used as a laundry room uh, this likely may have been part of the garage at some point in time but uh, it's the only room that doesn't have vents in it so that she uses this air conditioner and the home seller says that between the air conditioning fan and keeping the shade down, even in the summer, she can work in here. Uh, she does a lot of sewing in the neighborhood and so forth, okay? So we'll come back out. Again, this is the only, so this leads out to the backyard. This is the only step in the house right here. Again, a nice brand new door there. 
<clears throat> Here's the living room. We'll kind of take a step back so you can see what your view. Again, this is a really large window. Double pane, low E for energy savings. And then this is what the rest of this room looks like. Okay. Two closets, very much like what we've seen here before. And you see all the trim here too. The trim is the same wood that was used for the cabinets. So everything is done very nicely and what appears to be correctly. We'll go through the two. So this bedroom, we can't get in there because the home seller's in there. I did take some pictures for you, which I'll post. Again, more sewing stuff. Same flooring. This is all, uh, looks like a little bit of higher end flooring. Closet here. The AC vent intake is very low which means it's very easy to replace. It's not on the ceiling like most of them are. Here's the secondary bathroom. Nice and clean and definitely that well maintained. Just a view down the hallway. Here's your thermostat and the master. Again, consistent tiling throughout the house. And the same cabinets again. So these are all, you can kind of see, soft closed. These are definitely nice cabinets. Everything is soft closed. Here's the vanity. I mean the sink, I'm sorry. Sink, toilet, shower. Oh, and the closet. Okay. So you'll see too, the trim throughout the house is the same wood. Uh, it's really nice. This little area in the floor too, you can see it from the front door. And I do feel it here. Looks like it might just be a little bit of warped here, but I didn't see it anywhere else at all. Okay, just one last little thing here in the kitchen here. And I'll end it. There's this has been on the market for one day, and she's had all these showings. So a lot of people showing this house. Okay, and I'll send you this list of upgrades by email. Okay. Oh, I don't know if I showed you the view. Okay, I think we got it all covered. That's it.